Nita, thanks for having me at your workout. Yeah, sure. We have some 1K intervals today, but before we talk about the workout, yeah. how is the training camp going? You have only a few weeks, I guess, or a month until Seville, so let's hear how you're going in general. Yeah, thanks, it has, it has gone really well. Like, all the trainings are better than expected, and I'm feeling pretty relaxed and, like, comfortable with the trainings, and, yeah, I'm really enjoying to be here, because in Finland we have a lot of snow and it's cold and slippery and stuff like that, so yeah, yeah. it's perfect. All good. <laughs> I, I truly know the uh, the Finnish winters. I mean, we actually we actually met about ten years ago now. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I, I spent a few t a few winters in Finland, so I, I understand the yeah. the frustrations with the training. But so, how long is it to uh, Seville now? It must be is it 20th of February. Is that the yeah, yeah? Yeah. So there's about five weeks. Yes. So you so have some, you have some big workouts happening now. Yeah. yeah. This is my second hard week, and hopefully everything goes well, so I can do the third hard week and now I'm doing four quality sessions per week and then the long runs so yeah. I think it's a lot a lot of work right now but yeah. I really enjoy the hard hard one so yeah. it's good the other day you had, uh, you had a big day you had some 2k's in the morning and some 400 in the evening yeah <laughs> before we talk about today's workout uh, how did that go, how did that one go uh, yeah it went really well I I did the 2k's like six times 2k in in the times in like 3 20, 38 to 326 nice. between there and the 25 times 400 the average from them were 78.2 nice. so they were pretty fast i i was really tired from the yeah. from the morning workout but i felt pretty good when i started and i'm the like sort of person who who really like when i start a workout uh, relaxed and pretty slow, so the the progressive things work with me really well. Yeah. So the the last five reps were actually pretty fast, and I'm happy to feel the like like good legs in the middle of this yeah. this period. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, so today we have some one k intervals. Yeah. Eight to ten. Yeah. See how you're feeling. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, what's the recovery between them? Uh, Ninety seconds. Ninety seconds. It's yeah. a little bit windy. Yeah. Not too bad, but we're going to go up and down this road and try to maybe have a tailwind in the last couple. Is that the plan? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. And the goal pace is maybe start at 3.20, 25, is that right? Or uh, 3.30. 3.30 to start. Yeah. yeah. And then I see how it feels and okay. if it's a tough day, I do the 3.30s and sure. hopefully not. <laughs> sure, sure. So 3.30 is probably around half marathon. Yeah. yeah. Maybe slightly off half marathon pace. Yeah. And then build down. We should change. Yeah, let's turn around. So you're gonna do a 500 meter effort yeah, as part of the warm-up. Yeah, open up the lungs and stuff. Yeah, sure. Okay, so we're changing into the next percent for the workout. And you are supported by Craft? Yes. Yeah. So they, they support me with the clothes. Yeah, that's the top, Craft top. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, uh, pants. Uh, yeah, and the yeah. shoes, I can wear the shoes. Like, any shoes? Yeah, any shoes I like. So yeah. it's it's a pretty good deal because yeah. I prefer the Nikes. Yeah. But they actually have these shoes. I I actually start to like run with these on the like, thresholds and uh, like basic workouts. Okay. So. How do they, so they, that's a craft shoe? Yeah, yeah. Can I have a quick look? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Okay. I didn't realize that they did shoes, it's cool. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I and you think, you think, like, how do they sort of compare to a Pegasus or something like that? You think mm, they are a bit more, like, they are more like this. So it's, it, mm. it feels like you are on the toes, okay. like, easier. Yeah. And when you run on dirt and stuff like that, so this is a very good shoe for that also. Okay. Nice. And, uh, like, on, if I have done some uh, grass workouts, like on dry dry grass, so that's yeah. a good shoe for that too. Yeah, so yeah. it's not like too slow either. Right, right. So yeah, I, I enjoy it. Yeah. And now I have got some more of those. <laughs> but uh, like the race shoe and the vapor, so I, I don't know, I think it's just so <laughs> perfect, so yeah. I don't, it's... <laughs> the next percent is the... <laughs> yeah, you, you can't <laughs> like compare. In my opinion, one of the best shoes <laughs> yeah. out there, yeah. yeah. It's hard to, hard to beat them. Yeah. yeah. So we were catching up before this, um, and we were talking about other other 
brands that, that support you. And yeah. you're very proactive yourself yeah. in, in, in having supporters and, and partners, which is really cool. So who else, who else is involved with you in your running from uh, a brand I have perspective? A, like an IT company called yep. Ryzoft. Uh, it's a Finnish company and uh, then a logistics company, KWH KWH Logistics. Yeah. Uh, it's a Finnish company too, but uh, they, these two companies are pretty big, so yeah. I have a good deal with them. And then I have also like uh, a small startup uh, called Kolme Sadasosa. They're focusing on the beetroot shots. Oh yeah. So yeah, it's a, it's a. So you I, take them as well? Yeah, yeah. Very that's cool. that's yeah. a part of my race routine. Okay. And uh, interesting. You, have, did you take it today or just in not the race? today? Just Only the... races. Okay. Yeah. yeah. They are pretty intense. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, in, in what way? <laughs> like, they actually lower your blood pressure. So you, oh. I feel when I when I drink them, I, I, need, can... I need that every day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but they they like uh, yeah, I can actually feel when I drink them. Like wow. uh, it's the, the science behind it. It's, uh, it should like take away the lactic lactic acids faster. Okay. So yeah, I have a good flow when I drink oh, them. That's interesting. <laughs> yeah. I'm check that out. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but then cool. additionally, I have Kraft and. Yeah. Uh, Bear bells, they they focus on the protein I know supplements. Bear bells, yes, yeah, very and very uh, reputable com uh, yeah. company in only Finland or uh, outside. It's a Nordic company. Yeah. It's based on, like founded in Sweden. Sure. And then Vitamin Bell, it's a Swedish company as well. Yep. So I have them. So I focus on companies from like the Nordic countries, mm. and yeah, that's that's the line I I wish to have and. Yeah. It has it has been pretty successful. I don't know I don't know any other athletes with that many sponsors. So congratulations, <laughs> yeah. that's really cool. Thank you. But honestly, having having uh, somewhat known you for ten years, it doesn't surprise me that you've uh, been that proactive. Yeah. So uh, good for you. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah. You've got so many partners. That's really good. Yeah, but I, I like my tip for like other athletes who search sponsors is that no shame, just. <laughs> like push, yeah. push, push yourself through and <laughs> push and shove until you have uh, ten sponsors. Yeah, yeah. Or at least uh, six, I think, to be you yeah. mentioned or something like that. Yeah. So yeah. I don't get disappointed if I get a no. I just try another one Next. and like, or then I just push with more emails or, <laughs> or calls. So. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. That's really cool. Good for you. Yeah. All right. So, last question before you get started. Yeah. Uh, I know I'm asking a lot of questions. Yeah. What is? Uh, yeah. What will you take? Is in. Um, fluid or, or carbohydrates during this workout? Uh, today, nothing. Okay. I, I feel pretty, like it's it's not a big, like it's not too long in the workout, no. so I feel fresh with the, like I did some carb, carb drink to breakfast, but okay. I don't eat any solid food before, like my morning sessions. Mm -hmm. I usually fuel up in the evening, okay. so, and that's the, that's the way how I, yeah, I do my long best. runs, harder effort runs, okay. and probably the marathon as well. Okay. So only only doing like carb drinks before or yeah. gels, but uh, okay. yeah, of course I like it. I never run on empty muscles, mm. so it's it's not like a fastening thing at all. Okay. Like I feel fueled up. <laughs> yeah, and afterwards, is there a protein thing you take or anything? Yeah, like that? yeah, yeah, usually protein. Like uh, now, when I'm so long here, I I had some some with me, but now I only drink like hot like not hot chocolate, cold chocolate, like the yeah. the small ones okay. with sugar and milk. Perfect. So okay. it's all good. We'll get started in the workout. Yeah. You're probably losing yeah. a couple of seconds. Yeah. But then you get it on the way back. Yeah. Cool. So what was yes. the time in that one, sorry? Uh, 3.29.3. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. Keep that pace next to. Yeah. Yeah. So we're doing slight headwind for the first two, slight tailwind for the next two, yeah. headwind for five and six, and then seven, eight tailwind. Like you said, it's not too crazy, but it's uh, you can definitely feel it. Yeah. 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 Maybe more 
when I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At least you'll have a tailwind for the last two days. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. It's looking really comfortable. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. I think it's with the tailwind. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but it is good. Yeah. I will check the lactate after the fourth one. Next yeah, yeah, perfect. What ideally is your lactate going to be? <laughs> this is hard to tell because usually I do the thresholds are like 1.9 to 2.5. Yeah. But this is for me a fast pace. Hopefully three, yeah, okay. maybe. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but it doesn't, it doesn't feel like three. Okay. I think it's like oh, maybe I'm optimistic. <laughs> <laughs> Two point six. Yeah. That's pretty low. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, my dream was under three. So. Yeah, you said. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's really good. Really good workout so far. Halfway. Yeah. 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 Or four now. Yeah. yeah. But no, I I believe it's gonna go slower now. That yeah, like that way. Sure. Yeah, because cool. it's it's. The wind is yeah, noticeable. Yeah. It felt so so much easier. Yeah. Back here. This one was noticeable in the wind. Yeah. I think I'm gonna try to just keep that space and yeah, yeah. relax when I come home like that. Yeah. Ten seconds. help when you bike. <laughs> 312? Yeah. Oh, okay. Be careful. Yeah. At least you have two tailwinds now though. Yeah. That wasn't the air wind. <laughs> yeah. Nice one. But yeah, it helped when you when you're riding. was in front, yeah. Okay. But I, it doesn't work when I start like yeah. all out the first. So you like, to do, you like to do the first two a little bit easier and progress into it? Yeah. 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 Okay. Just get into the training and yeah. not to like push too much in yeah. the beginning. Okay. Tailwind time. <sighs> okay. Hey, this is the wrong. It's up there, I think, yeah. 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 There's, there's two lines close to each other, yeah. Okay.
What's going on? Nice. Times are faster than than I like. But the feeling's fun. Yeah, it's really good. But then I don't wanna like go on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> like just crush in a negative way. Go with your gut feel, whatever you think. I do if I do this and then see. I yeah. like take the left side. Three of one? Yeah. <laughs> now I think it's gonna be seven or nine. I think it's a good way to like end the training right here. <laughs> Three of one? Yeah, because it's a very good way to end it, yeah. Yeah, because I think the next can like the that yeah. can hit hard and yeah. I have one way to go 8.1 so okay. yeah it's yeah. I think this is enough I don't know if this is a silly idea but you could maybe do like some 200s or something if you really yeah. feel like keep going but if you if you yeah. feel like that's the end that's the end yeah. but should I like do I miss this workout up if, if I run one slower than one fast no no at all you should, I, I really I I'm, I mean I'm not a expert here but yeah. you should do what you really yeah. think in, in like yeah your gut feel. <laughs> you could do a cruise K, a fast K, or you could yeah. do maybe five two hundreds. Or... Maybe I try one more, but don't like cruise. It's, it's headwind, Threshold. so I just take a little bit of effort away, yeah. and yeah, yeah. yeah. Perfect. And then I can do the last K here. Yep. Oh no, it has gone over. In the, the... Don't worry about the recovery. It doesn't really matter if it's in the feet more. I go with the first. Yep. That was, that was windy. Yeah. Very strong. It's gotten stronger. Yeah. One more. Yep. Again? No, 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 no. But, yeah. I was uh, just practicing on running when tired. Yeah, yeah. That would, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't worry too much about the time. I would just run. Yeah, usually. how you feel and see what happens. Yeah. That's basically what you did in the 301. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah, well, it's, if it's not already, then now it can. Let's go. Three zero. Three minutes and a half to get. Yes. Freshness level is <laughs> on point. <laughs> I took twelve. I think it's twelve or something like that. Nine point two. Oh. Not bad. No. Yeah. This was fun. Well done. That was a really, really Thanks. good workout. You have to be happy with that. Yeah. But I think it it was good that we made that too. Yeah. Because um, that really 
made a difference because I thought I was really on the limits yep. on the 301. It taught you that you that you weren't. Yeah, and then yeah. then then when you said about like just relax the yeah. like the the ninth, yeah. so I. It I did was, say half marathon effort, but you went 3.13, yeah. which is 106 or 107 yeah. half but, marathon yeah, race. But it, but it helped, it was like a mental thing. Yeah, and yeah. Then, then the last, you just get, like, I knew it's, it's a tailwind, yeah. you're here the last race, but I don't need to do it anymore, so yeah. it was really good. Because now I got two really fast 1Ks. Yeah. Thank you so much. No, no worries. No this worries. Was Happy fun. to be here. Thanks for letting me join. Yeah. yeah. So turn you back into the craft shoes. Yeah. So what's your, what are your goals, I guess, in the near future? Uh, yeah, the goal is to run in Munich next summer. Yeah. My plan A is to run 10,000 and 5,000 uh, in the European Championships. Uh, if I don't get the spot, so then I hope I can make the, make the, make the, uh, like, <laughs> run the, Marathon in Munich, okay. but uh, like time-wise, I hope I can run 15:45 on the 5,000, uh, 32:40-ish on the 10, yeah. and now I hope I get to to run my marathon under 2:35 okay. in Sevilla, okay. and I think that's realistic. Yeah. Like the the 10k is the hardest one because now I'm not in the shape. I feel. I, I think I could do 33.30, 33.15 maybe, but under 33 it's a lot of, yeah. <laughs> like, I need uh, like a lot of training and stay healthy and yeah. and stuff like that, but yeah, uh, I just looked at the, it's 47 who, who gets the spot in the 10,000 final in Munich, and right now the rankings are like the 27th girl is running, her time is now 32.47, so so you need to beat that? Yeah, yeah, I need to be faster than that. Okay. okay. And I'm so to get into Munich, it's just the top 27 ranked? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Because now they they made the, like the entry standards were before before this summer. They, the entry standard for 10,000 were was 33.20 and that was my goal. But now they they switched the system to the, like the, the entry standard is now 32.25 mm -hmm. and then the ones who don't make the like time, they get to the like via the ranking. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah, it's 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 a tough tough time to beat, but uh, I don't feel it. It's so like it's there. I'm not sure if it's not next summer or yeah. later, but yeah. Okay. yeah, that's my goal. Definitely. And then of course I I wish I could could race in the uh, to the, in the European Cup in France. It's in May. Yeah. There is a really one, like a good 10,000 meter race, and I guess that could be a good place to to run a fast time. Because in Finland last summer we didn't have any good races, so I did all my races solo, and uh, I feel I, like a 10 10k race you can do the best time when you do all the laps of your, by yourself. So. Yeah. Well, people will be watching out for you. Yeah, thanks. Where's the best way to follow your journey? You're on Instagram? Yeah, I'm on Instagram. You have Strava, but I don't think you log on that much. Yeah, I, I never do. I, I don't use it. It's, uh, yeah, on Instagram and then my trainings. I, I'm i pretty active actually on Instagram. So I, yeah. I, I share my trainings there and then if, uh, like, I have this Sunto watch. Mm -hmm. So I have all the stuff in the app and yeah. it's closed, but you can find me from there. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, all the best in the Seville Marathon. We'll be yeah. watching. Thank you.